this is our project for ME470. It's a device that plays the piano for you. The inspiration behind this is Anna Music. If you've never seen Anna Music before, this is what it looks like. It's a digital orchestra, a bunch of different instruments being played by machines. This is the inspiration behind our project. We wanted to make something, a machine that could play musical instruments for us. So we wanted to design a device that could play the piano for us. And this is what we came up with. It's this array of solenoids that we'll talk more about later. Uh, we want to be able to play simple hymns, basically everything that you'd find in the hymn book, and have it come pre-programmed so that somebody who couldn't play the piano could take this to their religion class, or maybe even to church, and have it play the hymns for them. Now, the reason why we decided to do this is that there are other options out there, but right now they're either completely electronic, they're kind of gimmicky, or they're really expensive, like player pianos. We wanted to have something that's a little bit more adaptable, that you could just come and put on any keyboard or piano and it would work. So the reason we decided to go with an array of solenoids rather than a robotic hand or something like that is because this allows us to control everything seamlessly so it can play synchronously without having to move a hand back and forth, which introduces a lot of noise and a lot of room for error. This works a lot more smoothly and a lot more quietly. So the piano, piano playing device is constructed mostly out of acrylic and it has a front and a back rack and they are supported by four 3D printed feet and held together by four 3D printed brackets. And these, these feet hold the assembly so it spans three octaves from G2 to G5 with middle C right about in the middle. There's 37 solenoids in total and each solenoid controls its own key. Um, there's the black keys in the back and the white keys in the front. Uh, each solenoid is controlled by its own respective MOSFET transistor that has its own pull-down resistor. And each MOSFET is controlled by a pin on the Arduino, which is uh, dictated in real time by the Raspberry Pi. Um, based on which key needs to be played to play the song that you're, that you're playing at the time. Each one of these solenoids runs off of 12 volts, which is that power supply back there, and there's a 10 amp fuse to make sure that we don't short anything out if we accidentally press, say, more than 10 keys at a time. So like Austin said, this piano player is controlled by both the Arduino and the Raspberry Pi. So the Arduino doesn't do any of the thinking. It just acts as a slave, and through a USB cable serial connection, it waits for instructions from the Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi reads a database of song titles and their associated MIDI files. And it'll actually read the MIDI file for instructions and send the instructions to the Arduino to have the solenoids play. This is running on the Raspberry Pi. We're just connected remotely to it. So on this program, you can choose any of these hymns. And then when you're ready to play, all you have to do is just press the play button. Let's have a listen. <laughs> 